Good morning, Childress High School students. It is, um, I'm excited to talk to you today. I certainly wish I was standing in the floor of the gym looking up at you and speaking with you. But for the time being, this is gonna be the way that we meet. Um, as you all know, we are going to move the Childress High School curriculum online using the Google Classroom format. Many of you are already using Google in lots of classes. And if you're already in a Google Classroom, you're gonna stay in that classroom and work on the work the teachers assign. You need to access your student email because you will be getting invites to new classrooms that you have not yet been able to join. So you need to check your email and join classrooms. Another way you can join classrooms is I'm going to email you a spreadsheet with every teacher and their class and their class code so that you can look and join the classrooms that you might not have an email for. So the goal for Wednesday for you is that you have joined the Google Classroom for every class in which you are enrolled. Okay, that makes sense? Access, let's talk about access. If you have been watching TikTok or Snapchatting your friends all during spring break, then you are able to access the Google Classroom. You can use your phone, you can use any device, you can actually even get to the Google Classroom using a gaming system. So you should have availability to get the online access to your classrooms. You are more than welcome to park around the perimeter of the school and use the school Wi-Fi if you need to do that. Uh, you need to keep in touch with your cell phone service provider. Many of them are offering some, uh, some really good accommodations during this time, getting you some, some data that you may or may not have. So check with them to see what updates they have. You need to check in daily with your Google Classrooms. You may not have assignments daily, but you just need to check in daily to see what may be expected. Teachers may have you meet virtually and they'll give you plenty of time to set that up. Uh, they'll also be, you'll be able to probably view that virtual meeting later if you weren't able to make it during a certain time. But you just need to check in and be sure that you're keeping up with your work that way. Teachers will be available to you during normal school hours each day. If you have reached out to a teacher, please give them at least 24 hours to uh, get back with you. We, we're not sure exactly what kind of volume they're going to have as far as the, the number of, of needs that are coming their way. So give them 24 hours to get back to you. If you have not heard back from them then, go ahead and, and email them a, a second time. You can contact your teachers through their district email. You can also contact them through the Google Classroom that you're gonna be connected with them in. And you may also talk maybe through another form that you have set up, like many teachers have a Remind set up and you certainly can still be using that. You just need to know that you will be accountable for all of your work during this time. School is still going on and we are getting you the material uh, as best we can. Just know that it is not going to be new material. It's going to be lots of review for you and it is going to be very doable. I want you to feel comfortable and know that the teachers here at Children's High School understand that many of you are still working and some of you are keeping your younger siblings and many of you are sharing com a computer with several siblings. We understand all of that and so I think you're going to be uh, surprised and you're going to feel comfortable with the content that is being given to you. So having said that, you need to be doing something on your classrooms each time you are asked to do so because school's not over. We, we have to assess the work you've done between now and, and when we return to know, to know how to move on, to, to know how to move forward. You will be graded weekly. I'm gonna give you my contact information. If you have any questions, uh, feel free to screenshot this so that you have it available to you. If you're having any kind of online access issues, um, please call me and we're gonna work through those. Uh, there is, we, I do have a paper packet independent study for every class that is available, and, but I wanna talk with you about that before, before I hand them out. So if you're having online access issues, please contact me, email or phone. And again, it's been good talking to you today. I certainly miss your faces. Yesterday when I came in and, and the first bell rang, I have to say it made me pretty sad, so I immediately turned off the bells. I can't wait till the bells are ringing again, and I can't wait to see your faces in the halls. Until then.